find out what colour we're going to explore first. Red! Wow, red is a very passionate colour. Some people even think it makes you feel angry or frustrated. That's why people sometimes say, Ooh, I can see red! And they get really angry. Have you been angry before? How does your body feel when you get angry? Oh, fists. Yeah, I feel fists. My legs just, I start shaking in my body. I've felt angry a lot of times when I haven't had enough sleep or when I'm hungry. I call that being hangry. And sometimes I get upset when people take my things or when I don't think that things are fair. That's, I get really angry about that. But right now, I'm going to put some music on and we're going to think about how being angry feels in our body. Now, one of the things that I want to do when I feel angry is stop. Stop my feet. Have you got an angry face like me too? I'm going to do stopping around. Your arm's swinging like mine. Big stops. Oh, I'm so angry. I feel like punching. My arms. Whoa. Maybe faster. Even my head now. I'm feeling so angry. You know what, sometimes I feel like being angry on the floor. Banging on the floor! My head? No! Stomping again. Wow. It takes a lot of energy to be angry. I wonder what colour or tone is next. White. Wow. White makes me feel really positive, makes me feel light and my mind really clear. It's nice and fresh, white, isn't it? So clean. Now, have you ever felt positive or when have you felt positive and like you've got a really clear mind? I know that I feel like that when I have, when I'm eating really good food and when I'm sleeping really well. When I've had time to rest, maybe I've done some meditation or some yoga, when I look after myself. And how does that feel in my body when I feel all positive? feel open. Ah, I feel calm. I feel serene. And I feel like I can take my time with everything. It's so different to being excited. So slow. Being very mindful and watching where my hands are and what they're doing. Nice slow movement, nice calm movement. Nice and slow, maybe all the way down to the ground. Um, maybe stretching my legs up, or rolling up. Feeling nice and open.
and positive. Wow, that went so quickly. Being positive is a lot of fun. You really get into your flow. But I wonder what colour is coming next. Green. Wow, green reminds me of nature, like the grass and the leaves on the trees. But you know that green also represents, for humans, feeling jealous and envious. Do you know what jealous and envious are? It's when you're a bit upset because others have things that you don't. Have you ever felt like that? Have you ever seen somebody else have a toy that you really, really wanted and it wasn't fair? And then were you maybe a bit mean to them, you went and got it off them or you stuck out your tongue at them? Well, we're going to explore how it feels in our body when we feel jealous and what happens when we do with this music. Oh, there's somebody with a toy over there that I want. I feel like stamping a bit. Stamping as I walk around. I feel like being a bit silly because I don't think it's fair. silly but a bit of fun as well wasn't it I wonder what the next color is oh that's much more calming it's the color blue blue does make feel, us feel calm but then some people say oh, I just feel so blue today that's because the color blue we also associate with feeling sad and lonely have you ever felt sad or lonely before? I know I've felt sad when nobody wants to play with me or when I've hurt myself or when I see other people doing something that I can't. It makes me really sad. How does your body feel when you're sad? I already know that my body is starting to hunch over like this Punching over, my head kind of hangs, I'm kind of swaying, rolling my head to the other way. Oh, I'm so sad. my hands on my head because I'm 
So sad. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. I'm so glad that kind of finished. Oh, I was getting really sad. I hope the next colour's a bit better. I wonder what colour is going to be next though. Orange. I'm so glad it's orange because orange is an exciting colour. It makes you feel excited, ecstatic and joyful. When are some times that you might have felt excited? I know that I feel excited when it's coming up to my birthday or a big celebration. You know when I also get excited? When somebody I know has been away for a long time and I know they're about to come back. Wow, look at my hands. See how when I get excited, how it feels in my body? I just wanna shake and shake and I wanna let it all out. Can you do that? I've got some exciting music coming on now and let's see how feeling excited feels in our body. Jumping up and down. And my arms are pumping. So excited. Have you been so excited you just like can't contain it inside and go, yeah! And wave your arms about. Have you been so excited? Are you just gonna run around everywhere? It takes up a lot of energy, doesn't it? Now, I wonder what colour we're going to learn about first. Pink. Oh, pink is such a lovely colour. It makes me feel like I'm getting a big warm hug. Pink reminds me of being caring and kind. Can you think about a time that you felt like being kind? or you've had a kind feeling or caring feeling or feeling like love. I know I feel like I'm being loved when I get hugs and I feel that I'm being very caring and kind when I help others. And another way that I am kind to others is by giving them a big smile. How does feeling kind and loving feel in your body? How do you want to express it? I like giving myself a big hug. And swaying. And having a smile on my face. I feel like swaying. I almost feel like I'm carrying a baby maybe. Or my teddy, or my toys. I feel like twirling around. And then giving myself another big hug. And going around. Maybe going around the other way. And skipping when I feel loving and caring. And I feel like scooping. 
scooping movements, like I'm scooping up things for people. And my movement is all flowing. Ah, <sighs> pink is such a beautiful colour. Next, purple. Purple is a bit of a mysterious colour. It also makes me feel very royal and regal, like I have a big queen's or king's cape flowing behind me. It also makes me feel brave, like I'm getting the purple badge or purple medal of bravery. Have you felt a time when you have felt as though you're royal or regal? Have you ever been to a fancy restaurant and had to be on your best behaviour? Or gone to a party and gotten all dressed up? Or felt really brave doing something that you wouldn't normally do? How does that, all those feelings feel in our body? I wonder. I've got my chest out. And I feel very proud. I'm feeling very proud and brave. My head's up high as I walk around slowly. So I'm feeling very royal and proud. Walking faster. I'm imagining I've got a big long cape behind me and I have a crown on my head. Maybe we can even do some backwards walking. Can we walk backwards? And forwards. Head nice and high. Maybe a bit of dragging like that. Oh, and maybe a big curtsy. Or a big bow to everyone out there. Yes. Presenting ourselves for our award for being so brave. <laughs> that was fun, wasn't it? Pretending that we were royalty, that we we're brave and proud. Now, I wonder what colour or tone we're going to do first. Black. Wow. Black reminds me of the dark nights. Oh, it reminds me of tunnels, dark tunnels. And it makes me feel maybe sometimes, not all the time, but sometimes it makes me a bit, feel a bit scared and frightened. Have you ever felt scared or frightened? Yes, sometimes sounds at night make, you a bit, make us a bit scared, don't they? Or maybe you're afraid of dogs or spiders. Or maybe you just don't like loud noises. Now, how does your body feel when you get scared? Oh, I'm going to put some music on and let's explore what happens in our bodies when we feel scared. I want to just creep. I've got my shoulders crouched down, trying to protect myself from the noise, and I don't want to look. Oh no. Oh, maybe I need to go over here. Oh. I'm getting down quite low. Maybe hide over here. Oh, maybe not there. Maybe hide over here. Let's do some tiptoeing. Be very, very quiet. Oh, quiet. Very, very quiet. We might have to do some rolls. Get to the other side. And back again. No, 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 no. Oh. 
what's those sounds? Oh no. Oh, I'm so glad that that one's finished, aren't you? Oh, thank goodness, it's yellow. Now yellow is a very happy and cheery colour, isn't it? Yes, it is. When do you feel happy? I feel happy when I see the faces of the people I love, or when it's my birthday, or when we're having a celebration, or when I'm just spending time with family and friends. Those are the times that I feel really happy. Can you think about how you feel happy in your body? I mean, already I'm not crouched over like I was when I was sad. Right now, I feel upright and tall, and my face even feels upright and tall Look, and smiling. Oh, and this music just makes me feel happy as well. I'm bouncing. I want to clap. What other things does your body want to do when you're happy? Skip. Oh. Let's go for a skip around. Let's get those blues away with the happy yellow. So joyful and cheerful. Now, if you can't skip, maybe you'd like to gallop. Can you gallop? You know what I also like doing? Bouncing like I'm on a trampoline. Makes me happy. Waving my hand Up in the air All these kind of things make me feel happy I'm just dancing I feel so happy when I dance Can you just dance However you want to dance and be happy we finished with yellow and being happy well if you enjoyed today's lesson I've got plenty more that you might enjoy as well you might want to do one now maybe tomorrow so make sure you subscribe so you know when they're all coming out and I'll see you next time bye <laughs>